There's never been a candle that aligns your physical body to your spiritual side. Each scent corresponds to a specific chakra point. Lavender is associated with a crown. That aroma gives us a higher state of consciousness. Green tea lemongrass helps your third eye to gain clarity of thought during meditation. Seven candles, seven scents, seven chakras, seven ways to balance yourself. Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. We're doing a reading. We're get right to it, okay? Um, but um, before we start, um, we are moving warehouse. If you are not aware, well, you are now aware. Okay, I posted it in Instagram yesterday. So if you have ordered anything from us at eatreadlove.me, slight delay. I apologize. Thank you for your patience because we are just growing okay so thank you very much and i will keep you updated on instagram also so you know it's like oh it's finally here where you know where sal is moving yeah so i am moving to mars way ahead of all these people okay like these all billionaires okay i've been living in mars you know a long time ago okay let's begin all right so if it's a song i've been to paradise but i've never been to you how is it going with the taurus so i feel like um i'll do the i'll do two spreads here okay because that's what i started with the divine feminine today okay watch your divine feminine reading also mm, here we go too much though magician i came i saw i conquered and i am unlimited Oh, so you are like pasa load, unlimited text lang ng text. Okay. <laughs> unlimited. Magician, Mercury, Mars for me. Because okay, the red robe is Mars for me. But this is Mercurial, Gemini. Mm -hmm. It's more of a Gemini than a Virgo. Yeah. Because this is like learning what to do. This is your second house. Can be like your conversation, how you talk. Um, I feel like right now you're manifesting, of course. It's a magician. That's what it does. But the magician is a showy kind of card. That's why here it is in in the table. Okay, but now since this is this is your the way you operate, Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords, Ace of Wands, different Aces is there. So for you, it's like, okay, so what do I do? The challenge here is what to use first, which one to pick up when you're manifesting, because it you know manifestation takes process. It's a ritual, right? So if you're manifesting something, what do you do? Um, if it's a ritual, then do I do this crystal? Do I do this? If it's a job, then for example, it's like, do I apply or do I open a business? Uh, do I establish a corporation? Um, you know, or do I do a single, uh, sole proprietor, single proprietor? <laughs> I've been doing love reading so much. Sole proprietor, uh, uh, soul, whatever. Okay. Because <laughs> so, if you're a corporation. Because this is about like wanting to get big, wanting to get a project done. You know, this is also you going back to school. You're learning something. So you're saying here with the magician, I want to do so much. This energy is about very, this is, this is, uh, you're very active. You're very single with the magician. You got nobody. <laughs> Sal, why, why are you going to rub that? Yeah, you, I mean, it's a, it's a single card. It's number one. Okay. Your manifesting can be a soulmate also. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Ace of Wands. Now, I would put this here, but I feel like that's yours anyway. So you're choosing creativity, which is fifth house. You know, fifth house is where we create stuff. Because see, 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 it's where our happiness is also, is fifth house. So when you're happy, you're doing something. Normally, that tends to be um, something beneficial also for you with regards to making money. What you want. So this is when I coach. Okay. A lot of people want to go like, oh, it's summer. I'm going to go on a two-week vacation, you know, because work, you know. Like that. In my line of work, because I consider this as a job, as a work, as a calling, whatever you want to call it. I never really ask for a day off because I feel like my whole existence here in this kind of job, the thing that I do, is like a vacation every time. So I don't need a time out from being timed out. Because I see this as a luxury. For me, having a work is like so luxurious because... It's such a blessing. Oh, I know that's so cliche to say. It's such a blessing. But it is true. I embrace what I do. It's not a, a, a cross that I'm carrying. So I don't need to be removed from the burden. From, you know, like people look at their work as a burden. 
but it it gives blessing it gives us food shelter whatever like you know how it, you can provide for yourself so i never ask for a vacation because i look at my life as a everyday vacation like i'm always just on vacation so i cannot have a time out from time out mm-hmm. so my norm is like i exist on vacation mm-hmm. that's what i do and then it, it, it you know it gives me that happiness and creativity i'm just sharing with you as a taurus that's what i do i never that's why for me people are like why are you always working i mean you think i'm working i mean i'm having fun i'm eating a lot so i think this is a vacation <laughs> so ace of wands do something that make that gives you that spark okay now you're gonna say but not everybody sal is blessed like you like you're able to do um what you want with your life do you think i want to do this <laughs> i embrace it i accept it i'm not saying like i don't want to do it but don't look at it like I I want to do this a hundred ten thousands of times every day, right? That's what I do. I accept it, and then now it's like oh, it's just natural for me. Mm, that's what it is. Mm-hmm. So do something that uh, um, that sparks that creativity because this is a project. Oh my darling, I'm gonna give give it a give 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 it. I would have given this to you, Ace of Pentacles, but there's another card here, Nine of Swords. So I would have to give it to the other person now. Someone is stressed. Because you guys are not having a conversation. Because all both hands are facing away. Wants to give you this. But since you're doing this to yourself, they're not going to be reaching out. Someone wants to date you, but they're frustrated that you are more involved, I feel, Taurus, with yourself. Mm-hmm. Which is good. You know, People think like, oh, you're too much about yourself. But who's going to be about myself? You? You, you want? No, right? So let me be. Exactly. <laughs> I understand that. Like, I don't understand that. You're too much of... So, okay. Do you want? Or doesn't make sense again, right? So with the Ace of Pentacles, I find people really useless. Sorry. <laughs> Only thing I need is me. The rest is... Okay. <laughs> it's true. When you realize that the only person that you need is yourself for your growth you will invest in yourself and this is what i'm encouraging you're not a selfless hard cold uh you know cold person no you're not okay you're just taking care of what needs to be done which is you first rest will follow exactly so if you're doing you with the ace of wands there's nothing selfish here okay ace of pentacles with a nine of swords this person is having okay um I feel like, okay, oh, are we done? Oh, we're broken up. Oh, the authorities is not talking to me. I mean, they're all up in their A and in their head mm-hmm, about this Ace of Pentacles wanting to give you, wanting to date you, but never makes a move. Doesn't even have the, you know, the energy to reach out when you're all about your positivity with a magician. Okay. Mm. And I'm not angry. I just need lunch. <laughs> you guys are funny. Mm-hmm. When I say that at the, at work, you guys are funny. It means order lunch now. Sal is getting impatient. <laughs> With a hangman. Mm-hmm. Mm. With a hangman, okay. Yes, things are in delay in life. But for you, it's like this is an opportunity for you to work on something. When we we say it in my in in our language. Kung hindi uhol, hindi, I, see, I, did, I did like that. It was like, it's supposed to be dramatic. Mm. Kung hindi uhol, hindi bubukol, which means that if it's not meant to be, it's not meant to be. So, and for me, strike while the iron is hot, right? So go where you are being led to and not focusing on what you are not being given, you know? Because the hangman's like, of course, Sal, like I face uh, delays in my life right now. Nothing is really making, uh, you know, progress with the hangman. I'm tied to a person, tied to a job. But that spark inside you, it keeps growing. Life doesn't stop because life stops. Okay, because this is life around you. But here it doesn't stop. Your existence is here, not here. Does it make sense to you? Okay, because that's what I do. Okay. With the seven of swords, with this person right now, feels betrayed. Okay. Now they're tipping, uh, they're tipping, they're, they're walking on thin ice with you. So they know. So this person will lie to you so it doesn't trigger the ten of swords. 
they will avoid certain topics, why they haven't been reaching out, um, they would start to lie. Their fear of losing you, it would lead them to tell you what you only want to hear. Okay. So now we have a cheater. They will just tell you all these wonderful words, wonderful, wonderful things, wonderful things. Um, even in their life. Oh, everything is good in my life. Like, uh, you know, like work, you know, like very casual conversation with the Seven of Swords also. But it's all a lie with this person right now. Because you're not about them. Okay. Strength card. So the Taurus here is saying Four of Cups, Nine of Cups, Ace of Cups. The Taurus is saying here, like you're being compassionate to them, but you also need to show compassion to yourself. Okay. How do you do this? For you, it's just like, well, I if they come to me, then I would appreciate that talent. That's good. You know, I'm just gonna wait here. But I'm not being stubborn. What contrary to everybody, what's telling? Oh, I'm a Taurus. I'm stubborn. It's more of like, well, I have other things. I'm really committed to. I feel like you're committed to have something. Bigger or better than a relationship. Does it make sense? Strength card with the uh, Four of Cups. You want them to come to you, um, but you're not going to stop your life, you know, your existence. Okay. You see this. The Ace of Cups with the Nine of Cups. Wishing to be with you, right? Sem somewhat similar to Aries again. You guys always have that. You got all the Aces. No, you got another Ace. Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. So this person will express their feelings to you, but then since they're doing it out of fear, seven of swords to lose you, they will say sweet nothings. Ace of cups, nine of cups. I feel like sweet nothings. You will get it. I just don't like the seven of swords. It's in the center. You're going to get it, but you're not accepting of it. So they cannot just buy you, um, you, know, you know, they cannot just give you sweet words and then expect like everything is fine. This is what you're saying. It's like, you don't just come to me and tell me like, oh, are we good? You know, it's like, no, we need to discuss this because they're preventing it from surfacing. Whatever that they have lied to you or hidden from you, they want to conceal that. Mm -hmm. That's what this person is saying. With the Four of Cups here, it's like, I'm not going to buy that cell. Strength card. I'm not going to buy it. Mm -mm. They need to come with the truth. Okay. Well, I'm going to continue this reading. Link down there in the description box below for the extended. Thank you very much again, guys, for patiently waiting for your wonderful, amazing, um, you know, things that you have gotten from our store. Um, follow me on Instagram and I will keep you guys posted there. And you will see it. Oh, it's going to be grand. I don't do anything here bare minimum. But I do like bare minerals. Thank you. Okay. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. Let's see the extended. Bye, guys.